How you doing, guys? It's me, so... I actually never planned this at all, but... But that's just gave me a PC to fix. And... It, apparently the person said that it wouldn't boot into Windows. And I realised... There's no hard drive in it. So I've just thrown one in. So... So a laptop hard drive, it'll do. I'm not going to be doing anything extreme on it, so... It's a 15-year-old system. Packard Bell. And I'm just... Throwing... A copy of 10 on here. Because... It's... Even though it's an old machine, it could still run 10. 32-bit. Um, Intel Core 2 Quad. Hmm... Never heard that before. Yep, so now I'm just waiting for this to install a... Install um, Windows 10 onto a USB. So I'll be back. Okay, I'm back. I've just put 10 on here and now I'm just gonna boot it up and hope for the best. Um, okay. Hold on a second. Hear the beep. Oh! This drive can only boot into EU5. You cannot, you cannot boot in BIOS slash legacy mode. Boot this drive into. You should recreate it in Rufus using the following settings. I'm you. Oh. Right. Okay. This drive can only be booted. Right. Okay. Oopsies. I'll be back. So I found out my issue, why it went booting, because that needs to be MBR and on BIOS. Well, I'm just going to wait for that now. Okay, so good news, I managed to get the PC to boot via USB, as you can see. Whew, that was a pain. I had to do a lot of things just to get this PC to read that. Which took absolutely ages, but now Windows 10, this should be easy to install, get its drivers, install its updates, and send off. Now, to let this install. Okay, so Windows 10 is installing on that. And I'm warning you, this is not my computer, this is somebody else's. Yep, and I'm just waiting for this to install now. I'll be back. We have an oopsie! Recovery, your PC needs to be recovered. F8, don't work. Yep. Pressing enter, nothing's happening. Brilliant. Am I going to have to do a reinstallation? Yep, I'll be back. I'm going through some so damn much stress. I'm, go I'm on my laptop. Do I'm putting that on an SSD. I may not drive it yet, but I'm putting this on a USB SSD to 
install a goddamn version of 7. I put 1.7 instead of 10. Because this PC don't like to set 10. This don't like 10. This is my last chance if not. I may have to try another hard drive. Again. Maybe the one that I've thrown away because I because I think I booted the other one up. Oh well. I'm just hoping for the best. Change of plans. I actually ended up getting another USB since this one well since the other one had died, so putting um seven on this. Throw it on now, see if it'll boot on an SSD, I doubt it will. And just hope for the best. Yeah, let's boot this up. That's good. That's way that's very good. That's super good. Whoa! Hold on. This is extremely good. If you want to look at the specs, here you go. Ah, here we go. Oh, are you kidding me? I'll be back. Okay, I just wiggled them USBs around and detected. Now, let's get this installation done. Next, install Windows. Windows. I understand why there's like this gap here. It's just off centered. Aha! Home Basic. Nothing much. I agree. Custom. Are we doing this bug again? Maybe don't wait. Like SSD. These hard drives. Spun up that time. If you didn't read it that time, it's probably a dead hard drive. Nope, dead. Right. That's, a de that's the dead hard drive. <sighs> Come on. Please work. Oh, hang on. Oh, hello. Yes. Oh, thank God. Oh, thank God. We're almost done. Starting into Windows now, and don't sound happy. This is why it's done this for the second time. Just listen. Oh, 
Oh, it's actually booting into Windows. But yeah, it's actually doing some here, so sitting back watching some YouTube. The resolution has just changed to the resolution of my monitor. Now it's actually the entire screen being used. We're almost done. Okay then. We're actually doing the setup. This is actually what I was actually finally, 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 finally waiting for. Seeing this screen. How oh, hot's that card? No, it's not hot actually. Just this driving sound happy. Let's just share this entire boot up moment. It's first ever booting to Windows 7. Sorry for my shaky hand. For the first time, this PC has booted into 7. I was originally going to put 10 on this, but looks like I'm going to have to keep it on 7. Yes, this is the screen I wanted to see. That is the screen I wanted to see. <laughs> Got some progress going on here. Installing drivers. PC is doing completely fine. I need to screw that hard drive back in, but it's doing quite well. Just needs updates installing. In case you're wondering, it's um, this runs an Intel Core 2 Quad with a NVIDIA GeForce 8 8300 well, 8, GS, and the model of this PC is a Packard Bell iMedia. 1806 somewhere around here but if you're interested here is the inside I'm going to turn my monitor around so you can see the inside for a second guys are interested here is the inside nothing special System updates, yes I know. Um yeah, I'll be back. Hey guys, it's me again. It's day two. Really early in the morning. But I'm gonna have to get this thing finished. So let's get it done with. So where we was left off yesterday is that um we was updating this machine and when it's ready to go. I need to plug that one back in after this is done, but... So it's early after now, so it's just after an update, after some OS updates. I'll be back when it boots. Okay, we're in Windows 7. And now we're just gonna continue its software updates
starting the first set of updates, which will take time. Still waiting. Just got an error. So that's alright. I'm just gonna disable the firewall for a little bit and let it get updates through. Which will be easy. Windows firewall. Look at that. See? If I was disabled this antivirus real quick. That I do have done more copy. Hmm. Yeah, everything's up to spot. Um Ah. Yeah, we're back. Okay, just disabled the um, thing, disabled the firewall, now I'm just going to try again. Start updates, see you again. Hold on. I'm back, well I'm back now, but yeah, I'm pretty sure this PC is ready. It's got everything. Turn this firewall again. But by the looks of everything, it looks golden. Nothing wrong. And that's it. This PC is back in operation. Let's do one thing. Yeah, I'll be back when I get this done. Nah, I can't do it, but here's the machine fully working. Windows 7 32 bit. It took our 2 quad. NVIDIA G4, say 300 GS, I think. And it's. Packard Bell iMedia 8. 8106, 8306. And that's it. PC's fully built, well, fully fixed. By me. So, I really hope you enjoyed it watching me fix this damn thing, which took like right, this is the second day. But now. Since the thing's fully fixed, I guess I can actually calm down, take a break. I actually have to go to a charity boxing group fit soon, so I'm going to get this unhooked, bring it downstairs, and that's it. See ya.